What's going on everybody, this is Alex KGB. So really quick update, Bethesda did release the hotfix today. They actually fixed the issues that were in, reintroduced in the previous patch, keeping on the cha all the changes that were introduced in the previous patch. So the game is at much better state than it ever was. It's pretty stable. I think the dupers are being challenged as well because of the carry weight problems and because there's no more duping metas that work as they used to. Uh, so where are we going forward from here? I think the next step should be buffing the heavy weapons and the laser weapons, their durability and damage, uh, nerfing melee and reintroducing new content in the game. So definitely we should get more and more and more PvE, more quests, uh, vaults getting opened. I'm really hoping for the NPCs and one thing that I did suggest on Reddit and I will provide link in the description to this topic, uh, but I'm suggesting to add an event to respect your character because it takes a lot of time to respect after level 100 when you just take one level and then you can put one stat uh, from one attribute to another and i understand people that they were building two shot explosive builds and now you know what what they're gonna do it's not as powerful and maybe they want to switch to melee or a sniper build so having that event that will allow you by completion of event to wipe all your stats back to one at each stat and you have all the points to respect. I think it's gonna add a lot to the PvE and overall to the interest of the game with all the people that being not happy that they invested in this build so much and now they feel like you know their favorite toy was taken away. So if you wanna check out this topic, it's in the description. One last thing I wanted to add, pretty much this patch divided the community of Fallout 76 as of now. If Bethesda would add the respect, I think that would help people to kind of go through the process of adjusting to the new environment. But also, did you notice how easy it's to make everyone, even the core fans that still like the game, regardless of the bad YouTube press or people talking badly about Fallout 76, how easy it is to jump on the hate train. Really easy. So many people started posting Reddit, they're quitting the game, they're stopping playing the game, when the game is actually getting better. And the issue that appeared was fixed really quickly. Bethesda is listening to community, it's talking to its fans, and they're developing the game. We know the new content is coming, there are less bugs, there are less server issues, and people still hating more and more and more and more. And that just sucks. It's just overall nature, you know, of a crowd or people, someone says something, people follow and everybody starts following and hating. While the game actually does get better, maybe because of the all the hate, maybe despite the hate, but I'm really wishing a Fallout 76 project to grow and become more and more interesting. Alright, this was Alex KGB, thanks for watching and bye bye.